climate sense is really focused on a human. It's focused on an occupant. It delivers heating and cooling where needed and when needed. And the entire system is synchronized using our climate sense control software. The GenTherm Climate Sense solution is so revolutionary that we have teams of engineers studying human thermal physiology so we can make sure that the products we develop are optimized to deliver thermal energy to the person. Thermal physiology is a core of our development. We use thermal physiology to understand the human. And by putting the human in the center of our design process, we deliver the solution that is better than anything else today on the market. In the process of design of climate sense systems, we use combination of clinical tests, data collected on subjective feedback of occupants, and the simulation results. Modeling and simulation is an important part of GenTherm's product development cycle. From the test results, we can see that the performance is better than traditional HVAC. Through subjective uh, studies, we have seen that the time to comfort reduces by five to seven minutes when it comes to uh, climate sense while saving energy. Energy efficiency is equally important for internal combustion vehicles, conventional vehicles, and electric vehicles. So we see that in the future, both electric vehicles and internal combustion vehicles will implement climate sense. Even in traditional IC engine vehicles, uh, you can use climate sense system to save uh, on power and the companies can gain uh, carbon credits for that. GenTherm is looking at climate sense to really understand how this can impact the CO2 footprint for an OEM. One of the key benefits of our approach to heating and cooling is energy efficiency, right? We see a lot of companies now that want to be carbon neutral. Everything that we're doing that will reduce the amount of energy needed to heat and cool occupants in a cabin is going to have a positive impact on carbon emissions. Every vehicle today emits about 4.6 tons of CO2 per year. Today, we produce about 90 million vehicles every year. So this means that we emit about 400 million tons of CO2 every year. Climate sense can have significant impact in reducing this emission. We can reduce the overall emission of CO2 globally by implementing climate sense.